everybody this is domingo with you from d22 games hope you are doing fantastic and today we are going to be playing raid shadow legends but this video is going to be a little bit different because i will be teaching you how to level up so it is a simple process but not many people know about the process now currently my player level is set to 29 and i have 143,000 power now in this video i'm just going to make sure that i zoom in on everything here so if you haven't seen any of the details i'm telling you then uh, just let me know in the comments below and i'll be sure to annotate it properly so that way most people know what i'm talking about so raid shadow legends is a really good freemium game but it also encourages you to purchase things. Now, a lot of people will go the route of purchasing things if there's like a sale or if there's like a special offer on getting shards or money or gems or stuff like that. So I'm gonna show you ways to level up your champions without having to spend a lot of money. Now, in the hourglass window here, you have, you see what's called playtime rewards. And every 20 minutes of play, you earn a sacred shard. So those sacred shards, like you know, summon common, uncommon, or rare champions. Now, one easier way to level up your champions is to just use the shards of champions that you don't want to use. So you sacrifice champions in order to get your champions of higher levels. So this is currently what I have right now for champions. It's quite a bit. I have been playing this game for at least a few months and I've already amassed a huge collection. So what I'm going to be showing you here on the left side is the list of champions that I have from rank 4 to rank 1. So the rank 1s are the ones that you will normally use to level up your other champions. So let's say for example you've gotten a lot of Axemen. And Axemen is only level 1 and it can't go up any higher than level 10 unless you ascend it. But common champions cannot be ascended. If most people think that, well, you can't ascend common level champions. You can only level them up to the max. So let's say I want to level up my Jaeger up a higher level. So I'm going to go and press Tavern. And then I'm going to select my Axeman. And usually common level champions are worth 1600 experience. And then you press upgrade to use some silver, and there you go, you've upgraded your champion. And then you can also go into the ascend menu here, and if you have enough ascension potions, you can ascend them to higher levels with the purple stars. This basically increases their basic stats, HP, critical rate, what have you. And we're not going to ascend this champion yet, but one of the greatest ways to level up is to get the spiring pit. Now, the sparring pit actually requires you to use 300 gems per spot. This is by far one of the easiest ways to level up your champions because you just simply put them in the pit, leave it for an hour, and then the game notifies you when they're ready to be leveled up to the next level. As you can see, there are there's the characters that I'm leveling up, the time to the next level, and then the slot levels. The slot levels require you to use gems, but I don't want to do that at the moment. I don't want to spend any gems as much as I did. I mean, there was a good deal on daily gems, but that's the only one that I got. Not a lot of you want to do that. You just want to like grind it out and just go from there. So this is another option. You can use the sparring pit. And then in the battle menu, you can just farm. You can just go to the campaigns and you just farm. So you select the campaign that you want and then you select the stage that you want and then you select your champions that you want and then you use what's called multi-battle. So you get a once a day a multi-battle system where you can battle up to 15 times and your champions will get regular experience there. So that's one way that you can level up your champions. So let's say that you want to level up some uh, level ones right away. So you can go here and here and here and then you put them in there and then this is what you're up against. So it plays the same stage 15 times. So 15 times, that's about, I think, 15,000 experience or 11,000 experience, depending on how well your characters do. So that way, that's another way to do it for free without having to spend any money. So basically just farming the campaigns. I've already done the normal campaign, but there's still a few stars that I have to fill in for these stages. But I have to ascend my other characters still. But this is one way that you can level up champions. You can just farm the campaigns, 
keep getting artifacts and gear and shards and it, it's, it's all for free i mean they want you to keep playing but if you want to progress faster then they require you to pay for things so then also join a clan when you join a clan you get the opportunity to get rewards and artifacts to level up your champions so participate in the clan and it's a, that's one of the great ways to become part partly involved and you can also get uh, novice chests when you contribute to the clan so i just got a four star weapon and three star uh, magic potions to ascend magic champions and those are the ways that i know to level up your champions and then you go to shops here and then you get your seven day shards and then you go to your banks you just look for sales just look for sales as well if you want to spend money but normally i don't normally buy a lot i mean the only things that i have bought on this were the daily gem packs this is the only thing i bought the daily gem pack was all that i bought and if you get the daily gem pack it's like 30 days you get 60 gems per day some days 200 most days 50 but it's really helpful especially if you want to progress and then also one way is to unlock the gem mine where it's like 500 gems to unlock where it gives you gems and produces gems for your leveling and then also the marketplace the marketplace is a great place to get champions and shards so if you unlock all the slots here some of you some of the slots require silver some of the slots require gems but you can earn gems as you go you can earn gems from leveling up and participating in raids and participating in dungeons you can get a lot of rewards from that so i unlocked all the slots here and i didn't use a lot and if you're playing raid around christmas time you would have gotten a 5 million silver gift plus 200 gems so if you have still like around a 2 million silver like i do after spending a lot of money then you can still use that money to purchase stuff so that essentially is how you level up your champion so you just basically farm the campaign, you get the sparring pit, you go and summon champions from shards, and use lower level champions to level up. So, I hope that explains a lot. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time for another video.